I've been telling people for 30 years not to use a dry pad. I've been telling people for 30 years to wash your pad after every section. I've been telling people for 30 years not to wipe off with a dry towel. Well, even an old idiot like me can change because we're going to be using a three millimeter machine, not a rotary to finish. We're going to be doing it with a dry pad. And we're, if we're doing the whole vehicle, one pad would do the whole vehicle without cleaning the pad. And we wipe off with a dry towel. Why this machine? Uh, if we look at the rotary at 600 RPM, with a six inch pad is giving us 4.7 meters per second that that piece of abrasive is going around. With a 25 millimeter, or we'll say with 21, to get that same amount of movement, you need 4,000 orbits per minute. And they start at 3,500. So if you're using at speed two or three, you're well above that. The 15 millimeter DA at, four millimeter, at 5,000 RPMs is giving us four meters per second. So still a little less than the rotary. So speed, speed three, where most people use it, is 4,000 orbits per minute. And speed five is 4,400. That's why I cut with a 21. But if we go to a three millimeter DA, even though it's turning at 12,000 orbits per minute, it's only giving us 1.8 meters per second of that abrasive movement. And with the, uh, the app, we need the lowest amount of movement. So if we go to an eight millimeter DA, so I don't know if any of you still have your old DAS6 kicking around, okay. So that one, it's 6,000 orbits per minute, which is its top speed, I believe, or at least it was for the Porter cable. That's still only 2.5 orbits, or that's still only 2.5 meters per second. So we want two and a half meters per second and below to apply the app. More than that, because there's polysilazine and ceramic coating in it, you will actually set that coating and make it very hard to wipe off.